left armer can get them away with it. The crowd expecting a bit and a little bit. The ball's in the air. This could be out. Fielder down at fine leg is under it. And that's an important breakthrough for New Zealand. Jalia tried to help it on its way. And this is where it finished. Yes, not it didn't give him much room. Ball coming into him, choked him. Top edge. And it's taken down with a very good catch. And a good breakthrough for New Zealand. I think this is the wicket that they wanted. It's in the air, but it's through the gap. And that'll go all the way. This time down the wicket. It's in the air and plenty of gaps out there on the leg side. Got a... Oh, it's a great delivery. O'Connor's made a great start. And what a good start it's been for the New Zealanders here. And Aravinda de Silva. Two mid-wicket hit the pads and onto the stamps. And New Zealand would feel very, very happy having both Jarsaria and Arvida de Silva back in the pavilion. And now a... Well, that's gone fine down the leg side and Patel's too wide. Medium pace. Woods there, smashes it through extra cover for four. Good shot from Atapatu. This over tossed and hammers it wide and mid on for four. No need to run for four. Oh. Flicked it through mid wicket effortlessly. <laughs> Loud shout here and he's given him. Up went the finger. Ranatunga isn't happy, but this is a big wicket. Action from the bowler. It's only the wicket keeper who goes up. And he's found the gap here. This will go to the fence. Frustration back to the bowlers. Have to hurry on. This is going to be close. It's a direct hit. The Padu took a long time to turn. I don't think he's going to get back. He's gone. It's a five. Telegraph that time beats Harris. And the ball races. Gloriously driven by Telekaratna, getting on the front foot. Oh. oh dear, was this wise or did he get an inside edge? Oh. He's bowled in, looking to play across the line, the ball sneaked through. Sit, pressure being on, clean ball, good delivery. It's for five. And that's played beautifully through the covers. He takes the aerial route and he finds the gap. So welcome back. Crashed it through the covers. That's straight enough to go for four. Charging, hitting it straight, going to mid on. Will be out caught. Yes, easily caught. McMillan. That was a little unlike Mahanama. Forced indiscretion on him coming down the wicket, trying to loft it down the ground, not getting hold of it, but Macmillan completing a good catch. So Sri Lanka won. Straight down the ground. There'll be a couple here. Macmillan may get across. He does so. That could be four. Just a nick down the leg side. It is. Straight to him. If it hits, he should be gone. And I would suspect... The batsman's out by a few feet so that was brilliant fielding and Sri Lanka lose their next wicket to the seventh wicket for 188 that's right well that's a good shot that's been clipped away so Chaminda Bass is gone he tried to hit it onside work it for a single to give Kalu Wittara another Kalu Wittara trying to work the ball on the onside is beaten comprehensively by the straight delivery from Larson so Sri Lanka won 94 for eight.
This time it's fine enough. It could well be four. Ah, oh, bad bobble there. And he's cracked this through for four. That's a better length. Chopped down. It'll go for four. Streaky, lucky shot. Here, temperature-wise. And there it goes. He loves it there. Wood. A loud appeal. Yes, and he's gone. This time, Nathan Estel. As things have gone, Sri Lanka's way. Played and missed so often. This time, let's get in the for the last of one wicket. That's the dismissal of Brian Young. A thick outside edge. The ball going across his bat and. Uh, well, there he goes. It's in the air. There's plenty of room out there, and uh, Aravinda probably hasn't got his fast boots on. In the limited over game. This time he's gone for the sweep shot. He's hit it in the air. It's gone square. Good piece of fielding. Manages to pull it in. Down the track, and that's a good clean hit. This has come all the way and smashed into the side screen. Circumference. Oh, this has beaten everybody. This will go all the way to the fence. Jay Surya in pursuit. Their feet to him. Well, that's exactly what he's done. He smashed it over long on for. And he's given him this time. This was a ball of foolish length. Yes. And there you are, but Fleming go down. Might consider himself a bit unlucky. And he swept it fine enough. That'll be four. Charging and stumped by a country mile, so the pressure in the end told too much for Matthew Horn. He Matthew Horn tries to come down the wicket in the end, made a real mess of it. Just an upturn there from Jaya Saria. And uh, Matthew Horn, very dejected. 103. In the air and gone straight to Arvinda de Silva. Good delivery and uh, Kane straight down Arvind de Silva's throat. So New Zealand lose their fifth wicket for 120. Surya and Arvind de Silva. Oh, and he's gone. It's his third umpire's in the action. And that's out. He's out by a yard. He left to go. So another wicket gone and now wicket's falling in a hurry. 120 for six. This will go all the way to the fence. It'll be interesting to see if he got any bat on it. Yes. Boundary signal by the Empire. This is in the air. It'll be a simple catch for Tilakaratna. Rory getting the top edge only to find the field. Getting a top edge and a very easy catch for Tilakaratna. So New Zealand have lost their seventh wicket for 140. Hit across the line first and just see what happens. And this time. Luck is on Patel's side and it's run away. Well, he's trying to hit it, it's in the air and caught this time. Yes, it is. Well, hitting it in the air, trying to sweep it. Patel, really doing, taking a very good catch in the end. Well judged, hugged it close to the body. There it goes and bowl, tried to whack it away over mid wickets. And I think to be surprised that the ball hadn't disappeared into the uh, pavilion. But the only thing disappearing is New Zealand 152 for nine. And then you've got no idea in the end it's going to tell against you. But uh, Harris gets one away over the infield. Andres tries again. Goes over the same spot. This time he gets better contact. Oh dear. Close the face. Caught it. Slipped. And it's all over. And the Sri Lankans with their spinners have dominated this contest in the end. Well, there it is, a fitting end, really. Just a straightforward catch, just that the Sri Lankan spinners have had uh, sway over the New Zealand bat. Mira Lederan was the, the bowler to take the final wicket. There's jubilation in the Sri Lankan camps. And Macmillan really broke open the, uh, the middle order. And in the end, New Zealand...